class so today we are going to study how to create a blog what is a blog sir, anyone yes sir, a blog enables us to uh, uh, upload our post and uh, uh, tell uh, tell the tell the okay, No, actually blog is a website where you can put your own ideas to the world and you can represent yourself, your ideas, what do you think and how good you are at. If you are good at something, make a blog of that particular thing. See, if me as a teacher, I am good at expressing myself, I will make a blog of my teaching, isn't it? Or a topic. Let's say that we are making a video of how to create a blog. So, I am going to precise in my lecture that how to create a blog. So, just concentrate that you people are, all you people are having email ID. Yes, so, for what is the requirement to create a blog? First requirement, first and foremost requirement is Gmail, Gmail ID. ID. We will write Gmail ID. For example, I am ending what? RPS yes. Lab 2016 at gmail.com Fine? If you have this, what you want and only you want just to go to www.blogger.com What is this? This is the site where you can create your own blog for free. Just go to the web browser, Google Chrome or Mozilla Firefox, type your URL as www.blogger.com and then you will have to enter the ID and password of what? Your Gmail ID. So log in with your Gmail ID. Name the blog. Very good. Who said? Sarmesha. Name the blog. For example, Yes, what you have made, you can give your own example. Tiffin service in Bombay. Websites. You people might have 
team and you are searching the Google, it's www.google.co.in. Why? Because different different domain names are there. It is a domain extension. It is what? Domain extension. Domain extension. Dot .com, dot .co, dot .in, dot .cc, dot .uk is for United Kingdom. Limited. Dot .us is for United States. Different different countries are having their different, different extension of domain. So after this, you have chosen your domain name. Then after this, what happens? You have to post. You have to make a post. Now the domain name is there. If someone searches this, that www.rtslab.blogspot.com will open. But there is nothing inside the website. There is nothing inside the blog. Then you have to give a Post. You have to create a post. Click on new post. So while clicking on new post button, which is what? A button, orange color button. So while clicking on orange color new post button, you will be able to, uh, a page will open where you have to describe your web page that what, is, what it is all about. Okay, you are going to add images if at all possible. If there is an image, you are you can upload videos. No, yes, you can. You can, you can upload videos. You can upload audio. You can upload any multimedia that you want, and you have to design them. Sixth is design. Sixth is design. How the GUI, how is the graphical user interface? If the graphical user interface is the look and feel. As I told you earlier also, whenever we are landing on any page of the website, like what we see, what do we see? And how we feel about it. Then how much attractive it is, how much simply fine it is. If it is a simple website, be easy to go. Anyone can use it. Facebook? Yes, a green or a, a blue strip is there written as Facebook and anyone can enter his email ID and password and he can access. So very easy. That is why the number of users are more in that particular portal. How many of you use this Instagram? How many of you use Facebook? Hey, you see, because Facebook is pretty nice now. Because Facebook is a easy to go operable site. That's why you are having, that's why that site is having more users. So design, or more probably I would say look and feel. Thank you. Thank you.